what is going on guys so I thought you know maybe we should do a budget challenge today and uh, I thought we'd come to the wall of Mart and use $20 as our budget and uh, try to get a rod real combo and uh, maybe even get a bait within all that so uh, let's go you know find a rod reel line everything all the goods let's go all right guys so uh, we're going to be looking to get a rod reel with line uh, combo and uh, possibly bait within the $20 Right now we're going to be heading to the very back of the fishing section, so uh, catch a bit. So rod, reel, line, hooks, and bait within $20. I think this might be our section. Mm, you know I'd slay with both of these. 9.46 each. But, I'm looking for something a little bigger. Like, not those. I do not like that. These Zebco. 1774. This one, 1774, comes with all these baits and hooks. Huh. Come back to that. Come back to this side. I saw this slingshot for 988. Slingshot. Hmm. I think, hmm, I think this would be due. I don't think I need, I don't need all these. I don't need that juice. So I think, I think I might just go with this. So for 9.98, we got rod, reel with line. Now we gotta look for hooks and a weight because I'm looking to throw this on a high-low rig drop shot now for the hooks I am looking for something not too small but not too big mm, size 2 mm, maybe size 4 Am I blind? Where is the size for? Oh, there it is. There we go. Mm, is that too big? Maybe I should go smaller. Nah, I'll, I'll take size four. And those are a dollar sixty-six for the weights. Hmm. Half ounce. What do you guys think? Half ounce. Quarter ounce. I wonder what pound line this is. Stay on here. Eight pound. Eight pound line. Hmm. I think I'll go with the half ounce. And the half ounce is 94 cents. So now I got the rod reel with line, the hooks, and the weights so far for $12.48. And that leaves us with about, huh, $12 at $7. And why can't I do math in my head right now? $7 and 32 cents? $7.32. All right, so change of plans. We're getting the red ones. The red size four hooks. 
to match the rod. Unreal. A reason to start over new. And the reason is you. Now, for bait. I am thinking shrimp. And I was hoping they had raw, which they do. And what did I say? We had $7 and 32 cents. And I'm thinking the large shrimp right there. Which should be, so we got the rod reel line, bait, and the weights and the hooks for $17 and I believe 94 cents. So let's go check out. Boom. So we got the rod, reel, line, bait, weight, and hooks, and I spoiled myself with some Snickers. And we were still under $20, um, $19.45 to be exact, so uh, pretty happy about that. Now uh, the weather, we got some pretty heavy forecast, and uh, let's go see if we can catch a fish. Gosh dang it, I freaking... Did I really leave the weight at Walmart? I think I left the weights at Walmart. God dang it. Well, shoot. All right guys, so lesson one. Check the weather before you come out because I did not do that until 10 minutes before I left my house. And uh, Lesson number two, make sure you grabbed everything that you bought from the store. All right guys, so I did in fact uh, leave them at the checkout. So, not only did I waste my time, 30 minutes of time fishing, I, uh, you know, wasted gas as well. So, uh, like I said, before you leave the store, make sure you grab everything. Lesson learned, hopefully. Just a little update, when I left, it was like barely sprinkling, and now it's like somewhat raining. Uh, I, what I should have done was check the weather before, the day before I, you know, decided to come out here, which I didn't. I checked the weather 10 minutes before I left my house this morning, which it wasn't raining at the time. And uh, we are here at Port San Luis, or San Luis, uh, whichever you prefer to call it. And uh, we're gonna be doing something that I haven't, you know, done in a really long time, which is fish from the pier. And, uh, you know, I'm expecting to catch perch or cabazon, because, you know, it's a little rocky right here. Um, most likely barred perch, but there's also, you know, a chance of catching striped perch, black perch, and I, can't remember any of the other types of perch that they have here. 
I, that might be it. But who knows? So, uh, we are here now, and yeah, it is sprinkling a little heavy. So, we're still gonna fish, it's not gonna stop us. All right, so back to business 30 minutes later. Um, so now, you know, I got my weight and I'm on a high low rig with uh, two pieces of shrimp, scrimp, large, and uh, we're going to be trying under this uh, where the boat launch is. Um, hopefully we can, you know, catch some fish. And we got to be careful. It's a little wet out here. And I'm going to aim for right there. I'm sure the weather has, uh, you know, effect of me probably not catching fish today, but, you know, we're going to do our best. And, uh, if you're going to use shrimp, uh, I recommend you getting the raw or, you know, fresh shrimp. Um, oh, and there goes a piece of shrimp. Um, like, you can fish with cooked shrimp but you know more recommended is uh, fresh or raw shrimp we're gonna be making some money moves and actually moving on to the pier there's a couple kelp beds right here and uh, you know fish love kelp beds so oh, you're fresh oh thought a bird pooped on me wouldn't that be my luck? All right. Not exactly where I wanted it, but it'll have to do. All right, so uh, we're gonna be moving piers, a couple piers down, because I've been here for about hour and an hour, hour 15. I'm just absolutely getting nothing. Um, there's some also, uh, other fishermen up here that you know aren't getting anything either. So we're going to move over to Pismo, Pismo Pier, and uh, see if we can't catch any uh, barred surf perch out of the you know surf. So uh, let's go. So here we are, Pismo Pier, and uh, I wish that I had a heavier weight. Um, you know, I really didn't plan on coming here, but got to make do with what we got and uh, see what we can find. All right, here goes nothing. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are hooked up. We got a barred surf perch. Yes. Come on, buddy. Yes. Oh. Haha. -ha. First barred per surf perch. Ow. Ah, got a hook in me. Ow. Ow. Hi, little buddy. You guys have pliers? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Come on. There it is. Fish that uh, it's a barbed surf perch. Oh. Yeah, uh, you get a lot of these up here, and rarely you'll get stripers. Rarely. 
So what's what bait do you use in stream only? Uh, right now I'm using um, uh, shrimp. Shrimp. Oh. Frozen. Frozen. Shrimp. Uh, they like shrimp, uh, frozen shrimp. Uh, yeah, you can uh, shrimp. Um, what is that? Mackerel. Yeah. They like mackerel too, oh. and uh, Berkeley gulp sandworms. Oh. Yeah. There he goes. You guys want a couple pieces of shrimp? Huh? You guys want a couple pieces of shrimp? Yeah, you have one? Uh, yeah, I have a couple. I, I can give you guys some shrimp. I left my pliers back at the car. So, you know, luckily, you know, a uh, fellow fisherman let me borrow some uh, pliers, so... I'm gonna let him have some shrimp. My, son, my sons only want to play here. Huh? We came from Bigger, they want to play. Oh. Thank you so much. Yeah, you just cut, uh, cut them up in uh, little little uh, bite pieces like this. Okay. And you just throw it out there and just let it sit and they'll oh, come, okay. they'll find it. Okay. Thank you for letting me use your. Oh, uh... No problem. <laughs> there you go, back again. Ugh, I got sticky fingers. Yeah, at this pier, you're not gonna, you know, you're gonna catch numbers, but you're not gonna get the really the size you want. And also, you're gonna have to deal with uh, surfers. Um, I'm on this side because there's only, what, four surfers on that side and like 50 on the other side. So, uh, you know, I'm kind of limited to only one side of the pier today. But, you know, I got one. gentlemen we are hooked up again another barred surf perch Oop, gotta tighten the drag a little bit haha that's another baby seven incher hooked right on the lip oh, come on buddy oh oh all right get you get bigger how all the surfers decide to come this way. Yay. The sun is peaking a little bit. Nothing, nothing yet again. I've been getting nibbles, but that's kind of it. Keep eating my bait. But not snagging on a hook. Alright, gonna make a few more casts and then we're gonna head out because I got 
adulting to do. Guys, we're hooked up again. Another barred surf perch. It's three for the day. And all about the same size. Hooked on the lip. Nice. Ah, there we go. It's a beauty. You want, you want, you want uh, that's all right. Just catch one, oh, I know. You want, you want me to shoot that? Uh, oh. you, you want to see the fish? Yeah? yeah? I'll bring them over. You like touching them or no? They're nasty? Oh. <laughs> oh. <sighs> you want to release them for me? Sure. Open them in the water? Just drop them. There we go. <laughs> awesome. That is going to wrap it up for us today. I am going to clean up and then we'll be headed home. Alright man, I'm headed out. You got the rest of it? Uh, sure. There you go. Hang right there. Alright. Yeah. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, I had fun making it, so uh, if you guys want me to do this challenge again, but with like fresh water or, you know, in any other body of water, um, drop your comments down below. If you want me to hit up a different store, you know, drop it down below. Make sure to hit that like, subscribe, and uh, until next time, keep fishing on. Peace.